what is going on guys it's your body racing welcome back to another youtube video now guys today we've got something very 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 special in the channel we've got something very cool guys we've made it it's my first rlc in the channel we've had this channel for slightly more than a year we've never had an rlc and we finally have our first and this i'm proud to say it's mine it's not someone else's it's my very first rlc the lamborghini countach lp 500s in the spectra fame olive color that's right the green color because i think that is one of the best in the recent releases and i'm not even gonna waste time i'm not even gonna talk much about the box it's a very standard very simple box obviously we've got a red line club rlc logo on the sides right there the lamborghini logo right here as well obviously it's and it's sealed guys it's sealed so we are gonna dive right into the car together and oh my goodness guys i cannot tell you how emotional this is for me um to see all the little progressions that i've made throughout the last few months to finally be able to own this for my own collection the 1982 lamborghini countach lp 500 s from the hot wheels rlc lineup and we are gonna open it up and check that out guys Oh my goodness, so here's how it's supposed to be displayed, right? Obviously, we've got an RLC sticker right there, the Lamborghini Countach LP500S written at the top over there with the Lamborghini logo and obviously there's a little plastic bit inside which we are going to remove right now because I want to talk to you about the car. So we are going to very carefully, very gently remove that and the plastic bit as well and obviously you guys can see the door if you guys know me i'm a sucker for doors like this scissor doors carving doors so we are going to close the doors first because i want to talk to you about the car by itself so obviously this is the spectra flame olive color the green for the for you know for just just to be normal the green obviously is olive green color um there there are a few releases the black the red the, the blue Honestly, I like this because the interior of this really looks and make the car look that much cooler, that much meaner as well. And let me just try to fix. All right, there you go. So, yeah. So we are going to, I'm going to actually open up the screws and I'm going to actually hold the car as how it's supposed to be displayed because I want to talk to you all about this car. So let me just try to open it up real quick. I apologize for the delay guys I I have been trying to create more content but uh, obviously with this I'm actually I'm you guys cannot tell but I'm actually kind of shaking right now because it's such a surreal moment for me it's, just, it's a dream come true for me to own an RLC it's something that I've always wanted to do from the start and just to have this in my collection to have this in my hand to be able to showcase in my own display guys i mean you guys it's it's been it's, it's we've come a long way you know and it's just amazing so there you have it guys one more thing a lot of you might ask there isn't any serial number in the bottom of this car so obviously i think if i'm not wrong the black has a serial number to it but this does not so you might want to take note of that anyways guys here we have it the lamborghini countach lp 500s in the spectra flame olive color and we're gonna dive right straight into the vehicle so right off the bat on the right side of the vehicle we've got this amazing golden five spoke rims right here the wheels spin amazing well even for the front and obviously we've got something written right there which i cannot read at all i mean it's not because i'm blind but it's just not visible at all and obviously we've got this amazing paint job that glistens under the flash right here and i think it's just amazing the quality of it came out amazingly well and then obviously you guys saw in the start of the video this is the doors open right up which shows us the amazing beige interior with the bucket seats and the three-point harness or the four-point racing seat harness as well as the interior right there but we'll talk about that more as we progress along the vehicle so obviously we've got the aero ducts right there and on the other side as well and then the wing i'll tell you a little special feature or a special fun fact about the wing so you guys know that when they actually created the Countach, the wings were actually not from the factory. Lamborghini actually had to get someone from outside Lamborghini 
to actually come and we install the wings and these wings were actually installed in the car park outside the factory this was not inside the factory so a little fun fact i was kind of amazed because obviously the Countach is such an iconic car so i i do not know how to feel about that but it is what it is it is what it is and now um, it's a little fun fact for you guys if you look at the front of the vehicle obviously we've got the lamborghini logo and if you guys notice the logo on here is actually way better than a lot of the other lamborghini even the lamborghini premiums from hot wheels way better very well done obviously these are not plastic headlights these are all these are as usual printed no pop-up headlights these are just like little slots we've got a single wiper in the middle and you can see a bit of the interior as well also we've got more lights in the front more grills as well and if you look at the left side of the vehicle here we've got the same five spoke golden wheels rims and the wheels spin amazingly well just so nice to play with it once again the doors the scissor doors open just ever so perfectly ever so graciously and you guys can see the interior as well obviously this is a left hand drive you guys can see the steering wheel the gear shifter as well as the center console and if you guys actually look look properly you guys can actually see the pedals the accelerator the brake as well as the clutch right there which i think that little attention to detail is just phenomenal just fantastic super excited to have this in my collection guys once again massive shout out to drift 30 for hooking us up, hooking us up with this rlc and um this is just the start of something very new because now guys trust me when i say this i'm gonna collect all the other lamborghini variants from the rlc lineup that's a promise anyways we're gonna close the door for a bit right there and we're gonna move on to the rear obviously we've got lamborghini Countach right there which says um what does it say five thousand it says five thousand s it says lamborghini right there it says spec 500 in the license plate or where the license plate is obviously we've got a, all the rear um tail lights as well and the quad exhaust at the bottom right there and like i mentioned the spoiler i told you i told you guys a fine fact earlier on about the spoiler being placed outside the factory in the car park and if you look at the base of the vehicle guys check it out how insanely amazing is this this whole portion of the base really it just adds that much beauty points i know no one gives a damn about the base no one really looks at the base but for someone like me where attention to details like this matter i think this is a job well done lamborghini really did an amazing job with this with hot wheels obviously and um yeah just very nicely done the details here are immaculate obviously we've got the lamborghini contact written right here and obviously the licensing as well as the hot wheels logo and yeah all in all i think this is a superbly well done car if I actually show it the way it's meant to be just check that out all in all i think it's an amazing car i'm super proud to have this just what an emotional day for me it is but yeah just like guys i'm gonna do a few rolling shots of this amazing lamborghini countach lp 500s and i'm gonna see you guys in a bit i'll see you guys at the end <laughs> Just like guys, we've completed another video. I hope you guys had an amazing time. I shared an amazing time unboxing my first ever RLC. This is gonna go insanely by my collection. 
Let me know in the comments below, guys, if you guys enjoyed this video. If there's anything you want me to improve on, and you want me to co cover any more content, any different type of content, let me know in the comments below. I'll try my best to rectify and answer all of your queries and commands. But honestly, on a scale of 1 to 10, I'm super excited for this. This is my first RLC in the collection. I'm going to try to display them. I'm going to try to find a nice display for the RLC. I do not want to keep them loose i want to keep it with the boxes i really want to protect this car this car means the world to me but yeah just a little update uh the collection is coming obviously the whole shelf is not done yet we still have a lot of work to do but it's all coming piece by piece just like i guess this video is over i hope you guys have an amazing time and i'm out bye